Hi guys, this is Leslie Helva Harry with Jade Lotus and Jade's got some great information so we're going to get some information out of her on why, and this is not a joke, why penis size actually doesn't matter when it comes to sex, sexual alchemy and having fun with women. So, go away. Okay, mm. so um, yeah, I mean people are quite obsessed with penis size as being sort of the defining factor of good sex. You know, I would say that I don't agree that it's the defining factor of good sex. I mean, obviously you have a range of penis size. You have ranging from, there are some guys who um, I've had as clients that the penis is so big, yeah, they can't actually penetrate a woman, yeah, which is a bit <laughs> gutting, yeah, to be honest, you know. And, um, and then you have all the way down to like guys with micro penises, which might be sort of the size of my thumb, you know. Um, now, I mean, that's, wow, yeah, that's quite, but most guys will say it's going to be within, a, well? yeah, erect, erect, wow, okay. about that size, yeah. but wow. with most guys it's going to be within, say, four to eight inches is probably a normal kind of size, you know, yeah. and um, I mean, a lot of both men and women think, you know, that, yeah, like, you know, yeah, a matters. penis size yeah. is, is the most important thing, but a lot of the problem is actually what's happening is people are having sex in the wrong way. I mean, now obviously it helps as a woman if you do exercises, if you use a jade egg and you exercise your vagina and your, your yoni muscles. Why would that be important? For this? Just to have the muscles. You, strong. You, it's that, good that's to exercise cold, all muscles. Contract when it, when yeah, it you put an egg inside and you contract mm. it, you know. Now, having plenty of orgasms will keep your, your muscles as well in a, in a healthy state, you know. Mm. But say, for example, if you're not having that many orgasms, it's definitely helpful to like use a jade egg to exercise definitely definitely you know I would mm -hmm. say that but then the thing is like people are going completely about sex the wrong way mm -hmm. so if you think the vagina the vagina is it's a hole but it's not really a hole what it actually is it's like layers of muscles yeah like even inside the vagina you have like 16 different tendons holding all these muscles into place around the vagina mm -hmm. and the vagina can squeeze very very tight or it can be loose as well mm. okay mm -hmm. so um i mean i started learning this Taoist practice and when i started learning about jade egg one thing you learn with the jade egg is that the vagina actually has this reflex to suck on the penis so we use it with the jade egg and actually what you need to do to get this reflex to activate you first of all you need to be like really connected with your lover and basically you need to stop actually pushing things inside her now I mean like when you're starting with the fingers play with the fingers and wait to actually feel like a sucking for the vagina to suck inside don't just push your fingers in like this because what you're doing when you're pushing the fingers in is you're actually like re relaxing and deactivating the muscles and stopping the muscles from working properly and the same when it comes to penetration with your penis again rub the penis here yeah, and get it so that the vagina is actually sucking on the penis and then just start off doing slow shallow penetration because the shallow penetration is actually going to be like rubbing the g-spot and basically like um, activating the muscles. Shallow penetration in terms of the Taoist. So um, that you're just going in sort of just the, the, he the head end here yeah? okay. and what happens is more and more you're gonna be be like just getting the vagina tighter and tighter mm -hmm. so if you have a smaller penis it's actually like in a way you can even a very very small penis mm -hmm. what you can do is you can actually like learn to activate the vagina you know and maybe like a very small penis it might be more difficult in some way but it's still like it's possible to to do it you know mm. and then when you get up to like maybe something in more within normal size range like say four inches five inches six inches you know um you're you're completely within sort of quite a, quite a fine size to basically be able to get the vagina the vagina active and the muscles tight but what you need to be doing like the penetrating really with like a connection with the woman and really getting the muscles active and it's almost a little bit like when I talk to you and I hold your eye and we hold the contact and I hold it and that's kind of in a way what you're trying to do with those muscles you're trying to get them kind of sucking you know almost the way that a baby would suck on a breast or something like that mm. you know so um you know, and also the sucking feeling, like, it's much, much nicer for me because I find, actually, if I'm having sex and something, like, puts me off, like, I'm feeling a bit nervous or a bit scared, mm -hmm. I do notice my muscles just kind of relax and it f just feels a bit like I don't really feel connected with it, you know, I don't really feel connected with what's going on. Mm -hmm. Whereas if I'm really into the person and I'm feeling really connected, mm -hmm. then it just feels, like, tighter, basically, and, and there's much more of this kind of, you know... Um, 
sucking and especially if you're using the Taoist penetration technique which is using the shallow and then alternating with deep yeah, yeah deep, so you're yeah. going shallow 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 maybe nine times and then deep all the way yeah. and what actually happens is the vagina starts literally like sucking onto the finger mm. you know and then as well like you know the orgasm obviously like it's a kind of sucking or it's a grabbing you could say it's more like a grabbing you know mm. but um through the shallow and the deep yeah mm. and the shallow and the deep and being like really controlled with it you can create this real like suction it's of the vacuum, vagina a vacuum exactly you yeah. know because there's some women and they actually get the through a trauma what can happen is the vagina can become so so tightened it's called vaginismus and yeah. you can't even penetrate with a finger you know mm. um mm. but um but obviously like you don't want it to that extreme but you just want to get it like nice and tight to the level where it, you you're fitting with each other you know yeah. and a vagina it can expand obviously it can expand to give birth to a child it can also contract a lot and it's just about it's almost like tuning in the muscles to the right place right so when women yeah. say for example it's a criticism that they need a big penis then what you're saying in a way is they that need the to use a jade egg you to yeah stop these vagina they need to muscles. start the vagina muscles yeah. are being not used yeah. properly they're not being to... used properly and also they're they're not having sex with someone that, they, that knows how to have sex. So yeah, they need to basically use a jade egg. They need to start practicing doing exercises with their vagina. That's not a, a opinion that is going to please many people because that you're saying there that it's not in it's not another person. They need to do the exercises. They need to do yeah. the work. So they need to do. It's partly your fault as a, as a woman. Then it's not about fault or mm. not fault. You know, it's like I go walking, I go running, I do tai chi, I go rock climbing, I do exercises to keep my body healthy. Mm. Why should I not keep my vagina healthy as well? You know, my vagina is. Mm important to me i want it healthy so i exercise it with a jade egg you know yeah. and it's the same you know with any part of our body that we want to exercise you know through meditation we exercise the mind and i think you know exercising the vagina to get the vagina that we want mm. is what's perfect and i mean however our partner is you know but like a lot of rough sex and pounding in and out with a large penis it is going to damage those muscles you know that's another point so do you yeah. feel like a, a, a bigger penis could actually damage if they're not careful Oh like, yeah. It can really hurt, um, yeah, it can partner, hurt. Yeah. It can physically mm. be painful if especially if you're having disconnected sex with a lot of just ramming in and out, you know. Mm. Because you can go, okay, sex is like this, you know, but then you have obviously we were talking about the shallow penetration, shallow and deep alternating. Then Master Chia he talks about this screwing technique that both the man and the woman can do. There's so many different ways to play around with penetration with with the interaction of the penis and the vagina. Even I mean I find it really pleasurable just to put the penis inside and just hold for a little bit you know in that position as well you feel like a lot of energy sort of moving moving in that way so um i mean there's so many ways to have sex and i guess people have got quite unimaginative about it you know yeah, yeah. and about you know if someone isn't happy about what i said said i mean about for example that a woman should exercise her vagina it's it's really up to her how she wants her vagina to be if she's got a man with a ma massive penis and her vagina feels fine why bother exercising you know it's completely her choice you know mm. if she feels like she wants to have m more tightness in her muscles go ahead and exercise you know and it's the same like that it's good also for the men to exercise you know their sexual organs as well you know and exercise mm. their muscles exercise their bodies you know for love making and also just for general health because when both men and women when the muscles are not working well down below it also can lead to like well incontinence you know but then also like just the energy leaves the body you know and actually when a woman like if your muscles down below are in a good state you don't get very many wrinkles and you don't get like the the chin sort of dropping down you know but when your muscles in the vagina are not in a good good state it actually reflects in the face that you you age basically yeah, right. and that the muscles are kind of hanging down down here and yeah, all connected and so like if this, this is not working properly then yeah then nothing else will yeah so. yeah because it's like you know imagine if these muscles are just sagging down all the organs inside are going to just sag so down you know yeah. because this the the diaphragm down here is actually holding all, all our organs into place you know so really i think like i mean the way I had sex before I knew about all this stuff and the way I have sex now is very different because I used to just think a guy going bam, 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 like this inside me was the normal way to have sex. And now I realize it's not actually that great to do that. And there's loads more ways that are actually much more pleasurable, pleasurable when yeah. you get into it, you know. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's powerful. Mm. So thank you for explaining yeah. how yeah. penis size actually doesn't matter and the women and the man can do work. 
um, to make that more pleasurable. Mm. So thank you. Yeah. Thank you. And a man can, by the way, a man can exercise his penis. Mm. He can massage his penis mm. through like semen retention and through self-massage. So that's mm. massaging your penis this way and not that way. Because going like this mm. will actually make your penis smaller. If really? you massage oh. only this way, mm. you can grow your penis by about two inches. I have a client that grew his penis wow. by so about two. how do you do two. it? So pushing up. You just go f squeeze here and mm. pull it this way. You don't go backwards and forwards. Okay. And this guy, he grew his penis by about two inches in like a couple of months after oh, I taught him this exercise yeah, yeah, so, yeah. so um cool. so there's actually you know and also like even the meditate meditation actually meditating with your penis bringing mm. energy into your penis because massaging breathing? in this way breathing? absolutely yeah, absolutely powerful. sexual alchemy mm. massaging this way to bring the energy to the head but not back again mm. that's going to be bringing all the blood mm. and absolutely you can you can squeeze the muscles you can exercise the muscles and you can mm. add a, a couple of inches onto the, onto your penis size as well cool so, so, so there's ways that, that even the chinese talked about the taoists talked about that so they, yeah. were, they were interested as exactly. well for people that wanted to yeah. increase their penis and in terms of your erection getting a stronger mm. erection to squeeze release squeeze release squeeze release when you mm. have an erection this mm. is going to help the blood flow into the penis as well mm. and then just general massaging this whole area because you think about it mm. what you're trying to do is bring a healthy blood flow into the penis right. bringing healthy energy into the penis you know and um, even what we've been doing the the inner smile the six healing sound will make yeah. a, can make a difference because of the reflexology zones of the penis because actually like what's the most pleasurable for the woman is having a large head on the penis because a large head is going to really stimulate all those pleasure zones inside the woman mm. and it's this massaging from from the top to the head mm. from the top to the head repeat repeat and just grow the head grow the head and you can get the head really quite big and that's really the key to actual actually what's the most pleasurable for cool. the woman getting the head a bigger yeah is a good yeah one getting a bigger guys. head yeah <laughs> yeah literally yeah. Mm. yeah yeah okay so yeah that was really interesting thanks again for sharing jade harry holistic help with jade lotus on why penis size really doesn't matter so peace out <laughs>